Hi, this is Jacqueline Larita, and I am backstage at Anderson Cooper live. And I just, you know, today was a really touchy subject, a uh, really important subject to me. We were talking about autism, my son having autism. And um, the first thing I want to tell, you know, moms is, you know, it doesn't change the fact that your child is a blessing and a joy and they're beautiful, smart, and funny and they just happen to have autism. One of the misconceptions about autism is that it can't be treated and um, I believe that children can recover from autism. You know, as parents, I think it's our job to educate ourselves on all the information and resources out there to be able to help your child to recover. And um, everybody takes a different path. You know, for us, um, once we notice the signs, um, I went on to Autism Speaks website and they had a milestone checklist. I went down that. I got their 100 day kit and it tells you in 100 days after being diagnosed all the steps that you need to take for your child, which was very helpful. Um, I also got a lot of information on the gluten free, casein free diet. When you hear the diagnosis and seeing it on a piece of paper from a professional, it's a much different feeling than when you're just suspecting it. it it's very painful. Um, for me, I went home and I cried, and then I got to work. I started researching whatever I could because there's no time to feel sorry for yourself. you got to help recover your child. Now Nicholas is going to preschool, um, early intervention program with ABA. He's um, on the gluten-free, casein-free diet. Um, we've checked his food allergies to, to fine-tune his diet, found out he was allergic to some things we were unaware of. and you know, the gut does affect the brain, so you, you want to make sure your child is healthy from the inside out because then he'll respond better to, to therapy. I want to thank everybody that has reached out to us because it, it, we've had an overwhelming amount of support from everybody and I wish I could thank everybody individually because um, that's what we wanted by reaching out. We wanted people to help us and now we're going to help other people. And it's unreal them at the support system in the autism community that's one thing people need to know it's a huge support system everybody's willing to help everybody's got resources and information and you just have to go through it and find out what works for your child and it's just really important that you do that and and um, you know Nicholas is doing great and he's been a joy and a blessing and you know it's a journey that we're we're, um, we're on <laughs> our whole family is on and Great.